welcome back to my channel. So today I'm here with you for a video that was requested by a subscriber. Um, a couple of weeks ago I posted a haul and I picked up some of the eyeshadows from Coastal Scents, um, the Hot Pots when they were 99 cents. I think they regularly run for like $1.99 but they were on sale for 99 cents. So I promised that I would do a swatch and kind of review to talk to you guys a little bit about um, the, the quality and all that sort of good stuff. So let's just get into the, the swatch fest. So I have, um, I've already like swatched them all on my hands for you guys. So the hot pots are, here's what they look like. They're magnetic and you can put them in a Z palette. I'll show you my Z palette at the end because I had to kind of pull them out to make sure I could show you. So this is the size of the hot pot. It's the exact same size as a Makeup Geek Shadow and they are magnetic on the back so you can use them, um, you know, in a Z palette or whatever sort of magnetic palette that you're using. So let's just start and I'll kind of show you the swatches and then we'll talk about, you know, the quality of the shadows. So the first one that I have here, the shade Medieval Gold. And that's what that looks like in the pan. This next one is Deep Grape, which definitely looks different in the, um, in the swatch than it does in the pan. Next one is Timeless Taupe. This next one is Chocolate Berry, which again looks much different in the pan than it does in the swatch. Then we have Wild Raisin, which I love, it's so pretty. Then we have the color Flesh Tone, which is a shimmery shade. Then we have Light Tangerine. And the last one on this arm is Platinum Blue, which I love. Okay. Then shifting over to this arm, we have our more colorful shades. So this one is Orchid. This one is, I think you pronounce this Tulane, T-H-U-L-I-A-N, Tulane maybe, pink. Next we have Ice Ballet. Next we have Mauve. The next one we have is Petal Peach. This next one is Teal Green. The next one is Paris Green. And lastly, we have Island Breeze. So, as I mentioned before, um, they come in a, that you can put them in a Z palette. Here's my Z palette, and it's these two rows and then these two. Overall, um, for 99 cents or even $1.99, the quality of the eyeshadows are pretty good. As you can tell by some of the swatches, they don't swatch great. They actually apply better on the eye than they do um, on the skin, um, like on arm skin. Some things to note is there are definitely some that match up differently in the pan than they do in the swatch. So like for instance, um, the purple here doesn't really match up with the pan. Um, I did notice, and you can probably tell from the swatch, that they are a little bit chalky and powdery by comparison um, to some other different eyeshadows, but I think for the price, it's pretty good. The best ones are the metallic shades. Again, a little bit on the crumbly side, um, but nothing too bad, but they're definitely the prettiest um, and the easiest to kind of apply and blend. So. Um, for $1.99, I think it's a pretty good bet. So, I hope that was helpful for you guys. Um, they do last a pretty long time on the eyes. I meant, forgot to mention that. Um, they do last a pretty long time on the eyelid itself. I didn't, I always use a primer, so I didn't actually test them out um, independently. But with using a primer, I didn't really notice a lot of fading or smudging or anything like that. So, let me know your thoughts in the comment box below if you have ever tried any of the Hot Pots for yourself. Let me know what your favorite colors are and ask me any questions that you have below and I'll be happy to answer those. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!